music. Yes, we're on to ABBA, if you're a fan. Now, basically, Agneta Falstock, she's been a virtual recluse for the last 30 years, but the good news is, for all ABBA fans, she is back and she has given her first British television interview to us. Like thousands, I grew up listening to ABBA, which is why I'm intrigued to be meeting Agneta here today. She's back, and I can't wait to ask her why. So when you near me, darling, can't you hear me, SOS? I want to read you a review that I read about your voice mm -hmm. uh, from the new album, and I thought it was wonderful. The tender ache in her voice is still there, as if burned by love, and the embers are still hot to the touch. Oh. <laughs> Isn't that lovely? That's lovely. It's um, always good to hear positive things. <laughs> well, tell me about the album. It's called A. I didn't know that I was going to do one more. I thought that my last record was my last record. Yeah. And uh, then when the guys, Jürgen Elofsson and Peter Nordahl, came to my house and presented three new songs, it was very good quality. I could feel a challenge to really do this again because I love to record. When you love How was your voice after a few years of not, you know, singing regularly? Yes, it was a bit rusty to start yeah. with. I had to take uh, some singing lessons just to get back to th that old feeling. It's going to be the 40th anniversary in 2014 of Waterloo going to number one and winning the revision. Are there any plans to celebrate that anniversary? <laughs> it should be. <laughs> yeah, we have now a, a museum in Stockholm as well. So there's a celebration every, every year, I think. Let's talk about the clothes. It was a big talking point about Abba. Were the clothes something that you chose? No, we had uh, two guys that were suing for us. And I must say they did a very good work. It was good material to work in because it was a bit stretchy. Was it stretchy? Because yes. it looks pretty tight, the satin. Yeah, but it? it was stretchy, <laughs> so. But it was tight anyway. I recently um, did a sing along with a group of children and I said, What song should we sing? Waterloo. Yes. Because they, they enjoyed Mamma Mia. Yeah. This is it's, lots of youngsters loving. Abba. It's so fantastic because it goes from generation to generation. Mamma Mia! Um, do you see the other the people in Abba? Yes, we see now. We see each other now and then. Uh, I met Frida last summer uh, on vacation, and we we sat down and talked very emotional and talked about nostalgic uh, memories and and so we have something in common that only we, the four of us have have gone through. And yet, in in Britain, when we have weddings. There's mm -hmm. one song that is guaranteed to be played, Dancing Queen. Oh. Just gives you a lot of energy, I think, and happiness. Does it give you energy? Does it make you want to get up and dance? Yes, yes, it does. She's back. Thank you very much, Keris. And Agneta's album A is out on the 13th of May.